guys, we are watching something that has been a long time coming, a film that I have had on probably dozens of polls and countless people have been like, you need to watch it. It's such a feel good movie. It's so good. You're gonna love it. And you know what, Forget. We're doing it today. For today's video, I am finally, oh, I am fine, I hit my hand. I am finally watching Zootopia. Zootopia is a 2016 Disney film. Um, and I know, the things that I know about it is that there's Judy Hopps and Nick Wilde and it's like a, a rabbit and a fox and everybody in the entire movie is an animal. And I think that they don't like each other but then they have to like each other. It's kind of like one of those stories, but apparently it's really feel good. It's very heartwarming and it's really cute. If by chance, by the end of the video, you're interested in watching my full length commentary, review, reaction of this and everything that I watch, um, please be sure to check out my Patreon. It helps an incredible amount, helps me continue doing what I love and making more content. Um, and you also get to vote on polls for like what movie I'll be watching next. So if that's something you're interested in, I highly recommend checking it out. I'll link it down below in the description. So without further ado, let's get into Zootopia. A world where prey were scared of predators oh. and predators had an uncontrollable urge to mate and maul. Oh, oh Lord, she's extra. Oh, wow. Oh, that's a big mess. I feel bad for the janitor. Oh no. So she's always been extra. That's her personality. But over time, we evolved. Now, predator and prey live in harmony. Aww. I don't have to be a lonely hunter. Today, I can hunt for tax exemptions. <laughs> no! <be> an actuary. <laughs> There's such different careers. A police officer! That is the most stupidest thing I ever heard. Wait, why is that funny? 211 miles away stands the great city of Zootopia. Anyone can be anything! I love that! I love that sentiment. Thank you and good night! Her parents look really concerned. There's never been a bunny con. No. Bunnies don't do that. Never. Never. Then I guess I'll have to be the first one. I love her energy. I love her attitude. Cut it out, Gideon! Bad, bad. What are you gonna do? I hate do, Gideon's cry? stupid hey. haircut. What is this, the 1920s? Get out of there. Us predators used to eat prey, and that killer instinct's still in our dunna. DNA? I'm pretty much sure it's pronounced DNA. Dunna? He did not just say dunna. <gasps> Cry, little baby bunny. I love that, yes! Give him what he deserves. <laughs> I want you to remember this moment the next time you think you will ever be anything more than just a stupid carrot farming. What a jerk. I hate his hair and his attitude. He just sucks. Are you okay, Judy? They should all team up and beat up Gideon. Whoa! You got our ticket! <laughs> She's a hero. He was right about one thing. I don't know when to quit. I love it! Let's go! Utopia has 12 unique ecosystems. Oh. You're gonna have to master all of them before you hit the streets. Scorching sandstorm! Oh. She failed all of them because she's a bunny. Enormous criminal! You're dead, 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 dead. It's been a rough day, huh? She is really small. Just quit and go home, Fuzzy Bunny. There's never been a bunny cop. Never. Never. She's gonna fulfill her dreams. I love the determination. I adore that. I respect that so much in characters. Never knowing when to quit and just chasing their dreams. It makes me so happy to see. But I truly believe everyone should do whatever they can and have that determination. It is something that is, it helps life be worth living. ZPD's very first rabbit officer, Judy Hopp. <laughs> Let's go, Judy! She's so tiny! She's so small! This has been my dream since I was a kid. It's a real proud day for us little guys. Bell with her, make room, will you? Oh. Come on. Okay, <laughs> Officer Hop. You're just shoving her away. We're real proud of you, Judy. Yeah, I'm scared too. So many brothers and sisters, it's crazy. The only thing we have to fear is fear itself. And also bears. <laughs> you know what? Pretty much all predators and foxes are the worst. Remember what happened with Gideon Gray? When I was nine, <laughs> Gideon Gray was a jerk. Check this out. Oh, for goodness sake. She has no need for a fox taser, Stu. Oh, come on. When is there not a need for a fox taser? 
Is this like animal racism? Like, what's happening right now? This is. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, oh, gotta go. Bye. Imagine if it was just nor I just normal people talking. It's <laughs> awful. But I get it. Like cities have. It's a a city is a melting pot of so many like different types of people, or in this case, animals and cultures and stuff. It's it's definitely gonna be a culture shock for Judy. I think. Oh, that's a big city. Oh. I love that it has different biomes. Is this Shakira? <laughs> Did they label her as Gazelle? It must be so exciting. This is such a cool looking city. It's so inspiring. It's making me tear up. This is so sick. I want to go to Zootopia. This place looks so red. Oh my god. It's, you live and you learn. She is so tiny. <laughs> I love- one thing that I'm really loving about Zootopia so far is that they accommodated for all shapes and sizes and all animals. Like, they have the tiny doors, the tall ones, the- the the hippo transportation the hamster tra transportation like that's so cool I'm Gisele. welcome to zootopia that's shakira luxury apartments don't lose your key uh, at least they oh, have high hi. ceilings i'm judy your new neighbor well we're loud don't expect us to apologize for it <laughs> i'm surprised they even like responded crazy neighbors i love it <laughs> shut your mouth shut up I tell you, you are even cuter than I thought you'd be. In your neck, the fault. Where you went, you little dickens? An entire donut? <laughs> I, and the fact that it's like a police officer and they just, the donut, I, nice, nice, nice touch there. You ready to make the world a better place? <laughs> They're all such massive animals. 14 missing mammal cases. And City Hall is right up my tail to find them. Isn't this like detective work? Our first bunny, Officer Hops. Parking duty. You said there were 14 missing mammal cases. So I can handle one. Sir, I'm not just some token bunny. Well, then writing 100 tickets a day should be easy. So I'm not going to write 100 tickets. 200. I'm going to write 200 tickets. Heck yeah. I know her mentality. She She's that overachiever and we love to see it. We love it. Oh, putting those ears to good use. Well, everybody's gonna hate her. She wrote so many tickets. 201. There's our other main character. Do they- so do they think, like, foxes are really bad? Because, like, in the animal kingdom, like, they're- they're kind of known as, like, sneaky and sly, and they, like, steal and stuff like that. So I assume they're gonna have that kind of rep in- in this movie, too. Because they're just known for being like that. And he looks kind of sussy, doesn't he, now? I'm not looking for any trouble either, sir. I simply want to buy a jumbo pop for my little boy. There aren't any fox ice cream joints in your part of town. Uh, no, no, there are. There are. Segregation? He loves all things elephant. Wants to be one when he grows up. Is that adorable? What is happening? They have animal segregation in the city? I believe scooping ice cream with an ungloved trunk is a class 3 health code violation. Of course, I could let you off with a warning if you were to glove those trunks and... What was it? A jumbo pop. $15. Oh, no. Are you kidding me? I don't have my wallet. He's scamming her. I'm sorry, pal. Gotta be about the worst birthday ever. Please I hear the Jason Bateman. Keep the change. Officer, I can't thank you enough. Officer... Hops. Mr... Wild. Nick Wild. You wanna be an elephant when you grow up? Anyone can be anything. I feel like that child is probably like a, a grown man or something. Bye now. Goodbye! <laughs> Yep, it's a scam. It do be a scam. <sighs> I said it was it was a grown man, a grown animal.
Oh my! Get your popsicles! <laughs> oh wow, yeah, th those are definitely hamsters, all right. Very efficient. Wow. They have a whole system set up. Lumber delivery. What's with the color? That's redwood. 40, there you go. Hey, no kiss, bye-bye for daddy? You kiss me tomorrow, I'll bite your face off. <laughs> and you lied to me. It's called a hustle, and I'm not the liar. He is. He is slick. That's exactly what I thought was going to happen. You can't touch me, Carrots. I've been doing this since I was born. Tell me if this story sounds familiar. Hey, look at me. I'm going to move to Zootopia, where predators and prey live in harmony and sing Kumbaya, only to find, whoopsie, we don't all get along. So finally, she has no choice but to go back home with that cute, fuzzy, wuzzy little tail between her legs to become. So how about a carrot farmer? He roasted her and her entire existence from start to finish. Everyone comes to Zootopia thinking they can be anything they want. You can only be what you are. Sly Fox, dumb bunny. I am not a dumb bunny. And that's not wet cement. Oh my lord, he is so like set in his ways. She is inspirational and she has dreams and aspirations and he just seems so set in his own ways and like infuriating to be honest. Oh, Judy, it's okay. It was just a bad first day. Rabbits don't even eat carrots. A rabbit's favorite food is is bananas. As wild as that seems, I have been a bunny owner for like the last 11 years. I know bunnies. I know them so well. Hi, sweetheart. Hello, hey there, Judy, sugar. dude. How was your first day on the force? Amazing. It was real great. Holy cranks, Bonnie, look at that. Oh, my sweet heaven. Judy, are you a meter maid? Oh, it's the safest job on the force. Oh, she's not a real cop. Our prayers have been answered. Oh, my... She's not a real... Bye-bye. Oh, poor Judy. Leave the meter maid alone. Didn't you hear her conversation? She feels like a failure. <laughs> shut up. You shut up. At least someone's defending her. Yeah, but it might be worse. These walls are paper thin. I'm surprised if they don't lean on them, they'll break through. Yeah, you're a real hero, lady. My mommy says she wishes you were dead. It's exactly how people treat meter maids, too. I know they get, like, cursed out and screamed and threatened. My shop, it was just raw. Huh? Well, are you a cop or not? Oh, yes! Look at her go. Oh! Be the man! Wait for the real cop! Shut up! She is a real cop! I'm scared she's gonna mess up and they're gonna put her in a, in a worse place. <laughs> you can't just do that. That's- those are Mice's cars. Those are their homes! This is a nightmare! <laughs> Look at her keeping the peace. Excuse me, pardon. That is way too fast of a train. Have a donut, Kappa. Look at her hero. Thank you. Sweet. Hit him with the donut. It's probably like she caught him and they can't even arrest him for anything or something. the weasel. That's my job. Your job is putting tickets on parked cars. I don't want to be a meter maid. I want to be a real cop. Life isn't some cartoon musical where you sing a little song and your insipid dreams magically come true. It's a Disney movie. That's exactly what should happen. My husband has been missing for 10 days. His name is Emmett Otterton. Yes, I know. There's got to be somebody to find my Emmett. This is Otterton. I will find him. <laughs> bless you, bless you, little bunny. See, mm. you need officers oh. that care, that are for the people. A lot of them get stuck and trapped in their their assignments without, like, having care and passion and, co and compassion. That's the word. I'm going to open this door and you're going to tell that otter you're not be taking the case. I just heard Officer Hops is taking the case. No, no, let's not tell the mayor just yet. And I sent it. All right, well, I'd say the case is in good hands. Her voice is really familiar, too. 48 hours. But you strike out, you resign. Okay. It's a hard deal. Decision for two days? 
That is the smallest case file I've ever seen. My guy, can you just turn over to like the right a little bit? Popsicle. I have a lead. Hey, it's Officer Toot Toot. Ten dollars worth of popsicles can wait. I make 200 bucks a day since I was 12. I love the writing for him. Do you know him? I know everybody. And I also know that somewhere there's a toy store missing and stuffed animal. Nicholas Wilde, you are under arrest. Felony tax evasion. Oh! One million four hundred sixty thousand, I think. I mean, <laughs> I am just a dumb bunny, but you reported, let me see here, zero. How did he get away with this? And if you want this pen, you're going to help me find this poor missing otter, or the only place you'll be selling popsicles is the prison cafeteria. It's called a hustle, sweetheart. I love her. She did hustle you. She hustled you good! That is such a deep voice for Fennec Fox. Such a deep voice. Oh. I don't know where he is. I only saw where he went. It's not exactly a place for a cute little bunny. Get in the car. Okay. She booted his stroller with a fake baby in it. A yak? I'm looking for a missing mammal, Emmett Otterton, right here, who may have frequented this establishment. Yeah, old Emmett. Haven't seen him in a couple of weeks. Emmett doesn't seem like the type, based off of his family photo. This is interesting. Imagine it'd be such a big... Oh, you are naked. We're a naturalist club. They be naked. Gongi's just on the other side of the These pleasure guys? pool. Naked. Everybody's naked. These dudes have some questions about Emmett the Otter. He was here a couple of Wednesdays ago. He was wearing a green cable knit sweater vest, paisley tie, sweet Windsor knot. He has great memory. You didn't happen to catch the license plate number. It was 29THD03. Oh, I wish I had a memory like an elephant. Yeah, right? Who doesn't? Now any moron can run a plate. Any moron can run a plate? So you can't keep me on the hook forever. So can you run the plate or not? I love that she's playing him. Flash is the fastest guy in there. You need something done, he's on it. They're all sloths? Wait, I've seen this scene before. They're all sloths. There's a sloth named named Flash. They're gonna be here for like the next 30 hours. I'm convinced this is how the actual DMV is too. Like, like they, they operate at this exact pace. Buddy, it's nice to see you. Nice to see you. What? Hang in there. Can I? Do. Well, I was hoping you could run a play for you. Well, I was hoping you could today. <laughs> I was hoping you could run a plate for us. What's the plate? Two nine T number. Do you want it when? Oh my god, he has to type. Oh my god, he didn't. Oh my gosh, watch the system's even slower. Two nine T H D zero three T. HD03. H. D03. Nick is loving this. Look at him. Hey, Flash, want to hear a joke? No! no! Sure. What do you call a three humped camel? What do you call a three humped camel? Three humped camel. Pregnant. Oh my god! Ah. Uh. Uh, uh, Please uh, just focus on the hey. No, he's telling someone the joke. Flash. What? <gasps> Do. No. His name is Flash. I can't get over that. Oh, we finally got it. It only took uh 22 hours. Oh, this is infuriating. You. A limo to Otterton and the limo's in Tundra Town. It's in Tundra Town. Way to hustle. You wasted the day on purpose. I would never impede your pretend investigation. Look, see? See him? This otter is missing. Well, then they should have gotten a real cop to find him. That's hurtful. Fine. Here's your pen. Hey. You're a very sore loser. See you later, Officer Fluff. So sad this is over. I wish I could have helped more. The thing is, you don't need a warrant if you have probable cause, and I'm pretty sure I saw a shifty lowlife climbing the fence. Ooh! Smooth. She is friggin' good. She is clever. Zero three, this is it. Is he in there? <laughs> I asked if he was in there. I asked if the missing individual was in there for 10 days. 
if your otter was here, he had a very bad day. Those are claw marks. This is him. Well, now, wait a minute. I know whose car this is. We gotta go. Why? Whose car is it? The most feared crime boss in Tundra Town. They call him Mr. Big, and he does not like me. He's right there, isn't he? Oh, no! Raymond! And is that Kevin? How about you forget you saw me? Huh? <laughs> For old time's sake? That's a no. That's what they do in their free time? That's what they do? They they look at photos of the themselves strangling people? Animals? Is that Mr. Big? No. Probably like really small. Stop talking. Oh no, that is, that is him. I just assumed Mr. Big would be like comically small. And he is! <laughs> You come here unannounced on the day my daughter is to be married. Actually, is this a godfather thing? No. The one thing I know from the godfather? On the day of my daughter's wedding. I trusted you, Nikki. Grandmama made you a cannoli. And how did you repay my generosity? With a rug, a skunk butt rug. I told you never to show your face here again, but here you are. I am a cop. <sighs> and I'm on the Emmett Otterton case. And my evidence puts him in your car. She's threatening him. And I have only one request. Say hello to Grandmama. I some. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. If you're mad at me about the rug, I've got more rugs. Daddy! <gasps> she saved her life. She's the bunny that saved my life yesterday. And she liked From your the hair. Donut. Hi. I love your dress. Thank you. Put them down. You've done me a great service. I will help you find the otter. Oh, nice. That's why I always be kind to people. Aww. I don't even know what, what animal this is. True? I, I don't know about those tiny kids. Look at the tiny kids. It's really cute. Hmm. Always pay it forward. You never know when somebody could use it and all that. It's. Otterton is my florist. He had something important he wanted to discuss, but he never arrived. Because he was attacked. He attacked. He went crazy and disappeared into the night. But he's a sweet little otter. I think he's a little bit deeper than you think. We may be evolved, but deep down, we are still animals. Talk to the driver of the car. Oh, I'm excited about, I'm excited about this biome. Only he can tell you more. Mr. Otterton has, I feel like he has, a, he's like a deeper character. Cause he's like going to these nude yoga sessions. He's friends with the mob. Like this is not just a normal family otter. He was an animal. He was a savage! <laughs> he just kept yelling about the Night Howlers. The Night Howlers are exactly what we are here to talk about. Tell us what you know, and we will tell you what we know. Okay. He looks really sweet. I like that they're working together. Buddy? Are you? Oh no, he's going savage too. He's going rogue! Run. Run! Deep down their animals. And that's coming out with something. Officer Huxton, dispatch! Are you familiar with Gazelle? Greatest singer of our lifetime. Shakira, yes. <laughs> You're a one hot dancer. Tell you're a little tense, so I'm just gonna give you a little personal space. Oh, you saved my life. Yes, she wow. did. That's what we do with the DVD. Never mind it. Oh no, they're good. They got, they got those those massive jungle leaves. You're good. That was close. That was so freaking close. Oh, um, also, screen very dark, so I switch over to like this monitor sometimes. Mr. Otterton did not just disappear. They went savage, sir. Animals don't go savage. Sir, I know what I saw. He almost killed us. Let's go. Wait. You can't be like that. You think I'm going to believe a fox? That's racist. Well, he was a key witness. That's, and that's I am animal racist. You can't do that. Or you quit. Badge. Oh, her dreams being taken from her. She will not be giving you that badge. Two days to solve a case you guys haven't cracked in two weeks? None of you guys were gonna help her. Yup. We gave her the 48 hours. Yup. So technically we still have 10 left. We have a very big lead to follow and a case to crack. 
I don't know why he thought he could take the badge 10 hours early. Officer Hops? Nick really saved her there. That was so cute. Thank you. Never let them see that they get to you. I was small and emotionally unbalanced like you once. It's like a, a little, little backhanded thing there, huh? All I wanted to do was join Ranger Scouts, even if I was the only predator. Now raise your right paw. I, Nicholas Wilde, promise to be brave, loyal, helpful, and trustworthy. Even though you're a fox. What? <gasps> oh, no! If you thought we would ever trust a fox without a muzzle? So it's not even like... The predators were like bullying prey. The prey would get together to bully the predators. Like, there was always that division. I was never going to let anyone see that they got to me. If the world's only going to see a fox as shifty and untrustworthy, there's no point in trying to be anything else. But you can prove them wrong. Shark, how are the things looking on the jam cams? The jam cams. There are traffic cameras everywhere. I have a friend at City Hall who might. And clear my afternoon, I'm going out. You do have a meeting with herds and grazing, sir. I can just do you so bad to her. We need your help. Just need to get into the traffic cam database. How is this her her office is a boiler stock room? First of all, very, very never let me get this close. You can't just I touch it. Why? Why? Where to? Rainforest District. First of all, that's dangerous, like the stock in the boiler room. But, um, well, this is so exciting, actually. actually. So I mean, uh, you know, I, I never get to do anything this important. But he did give me that nice mug. Oh. I couldn't even get you an assistant mayor mug. He got you a dad mug and crossed it out. Timberwolves. <gasps> and there it is. I Both mean, of them do. Is it with wolves and the howling? It's howlers. Like... That's what Munches was afraid of. Wolves. I can see Jason Bateman's face saying that. All we gotta do is find out where they went. I would use the maintenance tunnel 6B. Right there. Oh. I think you'd actually make a pretty good cop. How dare you. <laughs> I love their vibe together. They're so complimentary to each other. That's a dope layer. That's a really cool evil villain layer. Looks sick. It's like waterfalls and stuff. Sneaky sneak. <gasps> They're so dumb. Gary, you're gonna start a howl. I didn't start it. <laughs> Do they- they have to do this? And they get, like, distracted. Oh. You okay. are a clever bunny. I like how they went from, like, strongly disliking each other. I wouldn't even say dislike, just not respecting each other. To, like, complimenting each other. In character. And verbally. Huh. That's always a good sign. I mean, what kind of oh, easy jump scare. That got me. That was a lot of them. Why are they holding them? It's like they're experimenting with them or something and trying to like, keep this disease or whatever. Monches. There's Mr. Otterton. Not including Monches. It's it's 14. Chief Bogo handed out 14 missing mammal files. Well, we've just found them. All the missing mammals are right here. Do another howl. Doctor, I want answers. Mayor Lionheart, please. The mayor's behind this one. The only animals going savage are predators. We need to come forward. And how do you think they're gonna feel about their mayor, who is a lion? Is this J.K. Simmons? <gasps> no! No! Here. <clears throat> you need to go now. That is 100% J.K. Simmons. Shoot, 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 shoot. Can you swim? Yes, I can swim, why? Gross. Would go off the side of the freaking cliff. Of course, they're on the side of a cliff. There's waterfalls. Why wouldn't it? Got it, Chief Bogo. You are one hot dancer. I love that. Chief Bogo. Wait, is that Gazelle? No. <laughs> you are one hot dancer. Can't you see I'm working on the missing mammal cases? Oh, oh, yes, that. of course. About that time, you are one call. hot she dancer. Wow, I'm impressed. <gasps> oh my god, that's so bad. <laughs> You were just trying to protect your job. We still don't know why this is happening. <laughs> they, they did something wrong. We did this together. Am I a cop? No. Uh, well, I've been thinking. 
It would be nice to have a partner. Aww. In case you need something to write with. Officer Judy Hopps. Yes. Well, all we know is that they are all members of the Predator family. Predators are the only ones going savage. Otters are predators? May have something to do with biology. You mean like that? <gasps> you know, something in their DNA. Oh my gosh, she did not just say that. She did not just say that. No, no, Thousands Judy, years chill, ago. chill, chill. Predators. Oh survived through their Judy. aggressive no. hunting instincts. <gasps> that's hurtful. Thank you, Officer Hops. Uh, that's that all the time that we have. No, this is bad. She, she induced panic. Oh, I think you said plenty. Reverting back to their primitive savage ways? Yeah, that's not what you gotta say. Nick, stop it. You're not like them. Oh, there's a them now. Oh, my lord. Judy! Are you afraid of me? Do you think I might go nuts? You think I might try to eat you? <gasps> no. I knew it. <laughs> that told her plenty. Probably best if you don't have a predator as a partner. He filled it out too. A caribou is in critical condition. This, the 27th such attack, comes just one week after ZPD this officer Judy We have to figure out why this is happening. The violence and it looks like that's what the mayor is trying to figure animals. out. By containing them and figuring it out. Go back to the forest, predator! I'm from the savannah! This is not the Zootopia I know. Oh, Shakira. We don't just blindly assign blame. Stop. That's so sad. sad oh, imagine time. seeing your partner like that. I didn't know otters were predators. We cannot let fear divide us. Give me back the Zootopia I love. The new mayor wants to see us. The mayor? The new mayor? Who's the new mayor? What are you doing? They're gonna move me to records. What? It's downstairs. It's by the boiler. He's like the most docile being in this entire movie. In this entire world. Um, I don't understand. They trust you. Chief Bogo and I want you to be the public face of the ZPD. <sighs> I'm not a hero. The world has always been broken. That's why we need good cops. I don't deserve this badge. It's what you wanted since you were a kid. She wanted to do right, but she felt she feels like she divided everyone even further. She didn't want to go off of what her parents were basically saying. And it a dozen carrots. Seems hey, like that's nice exactly day. what Come she on. thinks she did. Gideon Gray? He's our partner. And we never would have considered it had you not opened our minds. And one of the top pastry chefs in the Triborough. Really? I'll be darned. Hey, Judy, I I'd just like to say I'm sorry for the way- His stupid hair's still the same. I was a major jerk. Oh, I know a thing or two about being a jerk. I love the self-reflection. Don't you run through that Mindy Camp from Holly Cynthia's. My family, I would just call them night howlers. Huh? So, what did you say? Yeah, Terry ate one hole when we were kids and went completely nuts. He bit the dickens out of your mother. A bunny can go savage. The flowers are making the predators go savage. How is it getting around? Thank you! I love you, bye! But how did the flowers get into, into a predator's diet? Oh, Nick, night howlers aren't wolves. They're toxic flowers. I know you'll never forgive me, and I don't blame you. I wouldn't forgive me either. I have to fix this. But I can't do it without you. I was a horrible friend, and I hurt you. I really am just a dumb bunny. I really am just a dumb bunny. All right, get in here. Aww. Know this guy? I told you, I know everybody. Anything you Officially need, Officially licensed All your movies. Movies, movies that haven't even been released yet. Meow Anna? Meow Anna? What were you gonna do with those night howlers? And I ain't talking, rabbit. I some. I like that everywhere they went, they made friends. I want to name a Judy. I love. Uh... I stole him night house so I could sell him. And to whom did you sell them? We got a drop spot underground. Just watch it. I thought I had to do with the weasel. The second they said that scientific name, I was like, that's it. Come on. What's their issue with predators? The weasel though? wasn't lying. It looks like he's making meth. I've been watching too much Breaking Bad. Gosh darn, that show is so freaking good. 
Cheetah and Sahara Square. Got it. Listen, I hit a tiny little otter through the open window of a moving car. He's being... <laughs> Why is he shooting them and not the office, sir? Hey, Doc! Open up! All right, Walter and Jesse are back, so I'm leaving. <gasps> Walter and oh. Jesse? That's not... That's not... That's... That's... That's not... Oh, that, they're not even subtle about it. Okay, that's. <laughs> Jesse. We need to get this evidence to the ZPD. All of it. Wait, what? They were not subtle about that at all. I love it. Would it be premature for me to do a little victory toot toot? icing on the cake that was so good oh no the evidence everything is gone oh except for this <laughs> oh, yes! cut through the natural history museum so this is supposed to be manhattan this is supposed to be new york as soon as they said like melting pot and and where peep the big city where everybody goes and tries to be something. I thought New York, but I like didn't want to say it. Judy, Mayor Bellwether, someone's starting predators with a serum. That's she knows. what's making them go savage. She's evil. Oh, <sighs> <gasps> she always hated predators. How did you know where to find us? I'll go ahead and I'll take that case now. Uh, you know what? She hated predators. She's behind all this, and the mayor made her get them. Get it to Poco. I'm not gonna leave you behind. That's not happening. I can't walk. Prey outnumber predators ten to one. Think of it. Ninety percent of the population united against a common enemy. That's not fair. Ah! Over there. No! Ostracize an entire group of of living creatures. There's a word I want to use, but I don't know if it's the proper word. What are you going to do? Kill me? He is. No! No! Prey fears predator and you stay in power? Fear always works. That's scary. <laughs> Blood! Death. Alright, you know what, you're milking it. Besides, I think we got it. <gasps> they recorded it! Well, you've gotten the weapon there? Those are blueberries. Very smart. It's my word against yours. Pull out the pen. And I'll dart every predator in Zootopia to keep it that way. Mic drop. Beautiful. Guilty of masterminding the savage attacks that have plagued Zootopia of late. Did I falsely imprison those animals? Yes, I did. Doing the wrong thing for the right reason. The Night Howler antidote is proving effective. Aww. Damn it. Aww. Thank you makes me so happy so no matter what type of animal you are from the biggest elephant to our first fox nick he's a cop try to make the world a better place i love that but change starts with you we have some new recruits with us this morning including our first fox Nalov, higgins wolford undercover Hop. is this actually how it works parking duty just kidding. <laughs> Street racer tearing up. But is that how it works in like police stations? They're assigned every day. You know you love me. Yes. Yes, I do. They make such good oh. friends. Oh. They're a duo I did not think I needed in my life. I hope you have a good explanation. Flash. Flash. Hundred yard dash. Nick. Okay. This is his police uniform. Is he always on duty? 
That was so cute! Oh my god, I actually loved that so much! So, I just finished watching Zootopia for the very first time, and I have to say, that was an amazing movie. This movie tackled on so many different ideas, from like the underdog rising up to, to battling these social norms, like in, in Zootopia, you know, like people hate foxes, right? They're like, oh my god, they're so dangerous. Have like this fox taser and, and fox mace, and like just they hate them, right? You don't know them, so you can't judge a book by its cover. I was too immersed in the whole the beauty of the film. It was gorgeous. The animation was stunning. There was so much fun to be had with it. And I just, re you guys know how much I love the, the sentimental messages and, and the way they tried to like articulate. This film contains something that everybody can understand and enjoy and it has, it has to be one of my favorite Disney movies as of right now. Uh, your opinions matter so much to me and I, I would love to hear them. I just want to do better. So thank you guys so much and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone.